that's what I thought it was a pretty small design. And the go kart, when I tell them about the system, go kart did we just Yeah, go kart, uh, yeah. at peak we got a 82 volts. Um, we have a DC brushed motor um, that's powering us. It's really powerful. Uh, the current sprocket uh, setup that we have with the chain, uh, we can hit the top speed of about 50 miles per hour. Uh, wasn't that fast when we took it up in the race. Uh, we had limited a little bit down, but um, yeah, uh, we took it up to the race. We had one of the fastest qualifying times over there. Uh, uh, we had a great driver. Um, uh, during the race itself, though, uh, we got knocked out because of the University of Oklahoma rear ended us. Put us into the wall. Yeah, put us into the wall. <laughs> took out, took out the back uh, sprocket, but uh, we fixed that, and hopefully uh, we'll have two cars running. Uh, by the end of this year, uh, team lead for uh, go kart who's actually working on that. Tends to get the uh, frame remade, wants to weld all that himself with uh, steel tubes, uh, and uh, he has a plan for that. But uh, since this is so low to the ground, it's just fun driving it. It's a little bit safer for him than that. Oh, well, yeah, we actually have a professional yeah. yeah, he's a fellow student.
PBR used to sponsor them back in the day, so they had money to drop engines in them. Um, used to be a bunch of 21 or 18 year olds drinking out there, going 80 miles an hour downhill. Best idea I've ever heard in a while. Yeah, and an iron cast bathtub. <laughs> no, no, not at all. Society or something like that? No. Oh, it's just, it's just oh, it's just a, oh. I think it'll come from the meeting right now. It's like, oh, it's yeah, it's like, it's way back in all the time. Do you know about here or what? Oh, the dinner was